Hey, what's up, guys, and welcome back to the channel. Today, we're going to be hitting that new Seven Deadly Sins bit, and we're going to be pulling our girl, Malaskula, one of the Ten Commandments. And, guys, can I just... I was in the, the car with my wife and daughter the other day, just sitting in traffic. Uh, well, we were actually waiting to do COVID testing, so we're like, we were just sitting literally in the car, not moving for hours. It was quite terrible. I don't recommend any of you do it, because in my opinion, it's basically pointless. But anyways, the wife wanted to go, so we went. But aside from the point, so I'm playing my Seven Deadly Sins game, I look at my wife, and I'm like, babe, let me just show you something real quick. She's like, what? What do you want to show me? I said, what do you think of this outfit? <laughs> right? <laughs> and I'm like, spinning her around. And I'm like, and she goes, oh my god, that's like super revealing. You, know, you can see her underwear on the sides. I'm like, and that's not even the bad outfit. And I'm like, look at this chick over here. I'm like, look at this outfit. She's like, oh my god, this is a kid's game? I'm like, yeah. I'm like, babe, look at the back. It goes right up the butt. Like, anyways, I just thought it was funny that I was showing my wife that I play gotcha games on my phone where it's basically like, you know, kid porn, which is really weird. Anyways, moving on. Just got way off topic. Let's go back to that banner real quick before I say something that's gonna get me in trouble. <laughs> but you guys know what I'm talking about, right? Like, this is supposed to be a fighting game. Why? What's going on with all these outfits? Even, even for her outfit, even Masculine's outfit is like super revealing, you know? It actually looks really cool. I'm a big fan of the Shredder shoulder pads. So let's jump right in and pull a few copies because it's about that time. Escanor, right on the first summon. Let's go. Let's go, baby. Here we go. Yep, punch the ground, get pissed, throw a fit. We're just going to pick up your hand. So I actually did a couple more pulls on the Lilia banner. And I managed to get one extra copy of her. And I actually managed to pull a Duke of Blue Demon Meliodas, which works out great because that's they're basically her and Blue Demon Meliodas are my new PvP team and they just wreck city and as their super attacks go up even though it's not geared because i'm not doing really geared uh pvp yet having a higher super attack really helps my kim kingbrum team just kept losing oh by the way we're about to pull mascula right now because we always pull the new units on the second summon but my kingbrum team just hasn't been doing as well lately so i needed to switch things up and then somebody smoked me with Blue Meliodas, Blue Lilia, and Gother. And I was like, you know what? I know what I'm doing. I'm changing my units. Here comes that Demon Meliodas summon. The Albion gets wrecked, continues to get wrecked, and we're gonna get double SSIs, or just one, as long as it's the, the new SSI. We really don't care, right guys? As long as it's not friggin' Gil, we're happy, we're down, we're pumped. We'll keep going. Yeah, punch stuff. So I'm trying to boost the super attack of all of my R and SI units. That way when I go in the shop and I have to spend coins, I don't have to worry about which ones I spend because I know they're, they're already all maxed out. Have you guys done this yet? Do you even care? Are you as OCD as me and feel like, feel compelled to have to do this? That's basically what compels me is my OCD and I want to get my combat class of my entire box like over 1.5 million. Right now I'm like 1.2 million, I think. So, and I noticed, I think it's really cool. Oh no, it's Jericho, but I needed one more dupe to max her out. Can't really get mad about it. You know, Jericho's getting pissed because, you know, everyone in the beginning was like waifu Jericho. And then this new Mascula card came out and everyone's thinking like she looks better maybe. I don't know, Jericho got pissed, so she showed up. Just to make sure we, we didn't forget about her. That's fine. But we boosted that super attack now uh, to six. I'm pretty sure she's at five. So not, not too bad of a pull. But we got to keep going because we need to make sure we pull the unit that we want the most. Which is the new Ten Commandment. Here we go. I feel like, yeah, like I felt like the hand was going to get knocked back. And I should have said it before it happened because then you guys are like, well, you saw it happen. That's why you felt that way. I just had a feeling the hand was going to get knocked back. I don't know. The sky looked a little different. It's like usually when you can see the sun not completely setting in the sky, you're going to knock the hand back. Two this time? Okay, just one. I think it might be the first one. No? Maybe the second one? 
I always forget how that rotation falls. Or maybe it's the last one. All right, Gunther, chill. Just chill. Lots of Hausers. By the way, I did buy the, the Hauser uh, set that was available in the store. It's pretty awesome. Especially if you have your Hauser maxed out like I do. Like, he just wrecks. And when his super attack is maxed out, he depletes ultimate orb, um, ultimate gauge orbs. I don't know if you guys knew that. He basically, like, depletes one orb per, like, buff that the enemy has or something like that. Come on! Oh! Dude! Grandmore! Always showing up when you don't want him to! Okay, we'll go again. Do you, Demon Mascula, Masculita, Mascula, whatever the hell you say her name, show up! And we got the the crisscross sky hand hand knockback, which is pretty sweet. These multis are fire. I don't know what it is. Maybe it's because I went for a four mile run and I got super hyped up, and I'm just pulling in all kinds of spirit bomb luck right now. Come on, let's go. Let's go. This is gonna be it right here. Get ready. Put those hands up. Here we go. This is gonna be, this is gonna be the pull. This is gonna be the pull. Come on. Yeah, get out of the way, Taizo. We just wanna go right to the SSI pull. Come on, let's go, let's go. I keep pulling multiple copies of him, too. Oh, it's Justin Elizabeth. Oh, skip. <laughs> maybe maybe the game's mad because I'm saying her name wrong. Let me just go back. I don't like keep messing up her name. Melascula. Melascula of Faith. All right, Melascula. Let's go. It'd actually be really cool to pull her on an Escanor summon because she gets beasted by Escanor when he, she tries to eat his soul. So like if we pull her right now, cause I saw that sun on the top right. If we pull her right now, that would mean I called it. Cause I said it would be beast to pull her on an Escanor summon. You guys heard me before the sun even showed up on that top right. Yes. Oh, where's your boy? Oh, don't worry, Meliodas. Escanor's got this, and he only needs one finger to make it happen. Yeah! <laughs> if this doesn't bring him a Lescula, I don't know what will. Should have like 10 diamonds on here for that one, right? Do you imagine it showed a whole circle of SSIs? Like the game just broke. <laughs> that would be sick, right? It'll happen. It'll happen one day. You just gotta put that positive energy out there. Come on, come on, come on, come on! Yeah! <laughs> Dude, it's just so much better. It is just so much better when I literally call the exact animation that's gonna make the unit show up. Like, you just can't, you just can't deny the fact that I do that all the time. Like, all the time. I always call the animation. Oh, that was so good. Oh, that was so awesome. Let's see if we can get dupes. Come on, let's go. Let's go dupes, let's go dupes. Come on, baby, hit, let's go. Let's see that tongue. Come on. Is it gonna be it? Last one? It's gonna be the last one. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Uh, and it's Gil. See, I told you, Gil always shows up to, to friggin' ruin the potty. Oh, yes. I am going to sit back and relax and enjoy, because that was beast. That was like only one dead multi out of that, and we got the Escanor summon. Dude, if you get absolutely hyped watching my videos, and you get pumped and full of good energy, go down there and tap that like button and if you want to make sure you don't miss new content from me, obviously click subscribe and tap that notification bell so you never miss a new video upload. Guys, I am just so pumped. I'm so happy. And I'm also super hungry. So I'm going to get some food, take a little break from this, 
and I'll be back with more videos and more Call of Duty live streaming, I promise, real soon. Have a great day, guys. Stay safe, and I'll see you next time.